Hello, people. I'm here with a very dear friend of mine again. I invited him to start the Rapid Round Game, which is the name of a new segment for my channel. And here with me is Denik. This guy is awesome. He has a Discord server. He should be there as well. Thank you, my friend, for being here. How are you today? Hello, Rod. Thanks for having me. It's always a pleasure to come back. I'm all right. Yeah, thanks. Let's right. start playing. As you are the guest, I'm going to let you start, all right? Your favorite vocabulary theme to teach? Everyday yeah. life. Like, I, I'm talking to you and I want to know how your day was. What did you do? Like, you played soccer, you listened to yeah, music, yeah, yeah. you know, this kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's quite nice. I do it a lot myself, so. What's your favorite kind of activity to use in your class? The rapid round questions. <laughs> because I make my students think fast right. to find an answer for me. So they yeah. have to exercise their thinking much more. You like to keep them on, in, on, the, on their toes. Yeah, I do. Yeah. Can you describe your worst nightmare student? <laughs> I think it was when a student was with roller skates inside the classroom. But you know, teenagers are crazy. <laughs> okay. These three questions were about Rod, English teacher. Uh, the following questions that I have prepared are more about Rod, the human being. <laughs> That's how I decided to divide it. Fast food or vegan diet? Fast food, I'm sorry. <laughs> Okay. A book or a TV show? Both. I'm a bookworm and I love TV shows. Lovely. Those were my questions that I've prepared for you. Awesome. Now it's my turn, right? Besides sports, what do you like to do most? Games of any kind. I can tell. Board games, sometimes yeah. computer games, video games, because, I mean, it gives me a similar feel, right? It's mm -hmm. competitive. Aspect and I like it a lot. Yes, I agree. You might call me obsessed, but, <laughs> but this is who I am. A place you would like to travel to after the pandemic is over. I'm going to be as boring as I normally am. When you are teaching, how does it feel? As you can see, it can sometimes be a roller coaster of emotions, ranging from the worst emotions imaginable, uh, going mm -hmm. up to the most wonderful feelings. And I would say the most rewarding things when a student tells you that they are grateful for your work and what and how you have inspired them and how you have managed to help them to achieve their goals. I think that's the most rewarding feeling. Mm -hmm. It's not that they tell you you are a good teacher. It's nice. It's always nice to hear it. It's it's like we yes. all fish for those for such compliments. So that's I think that's natural, and we are happy yeah. to hear. It such things yeah. but actually this is even more mm -hmm. for me because then i sometimes first of all i'm not sure if the, the students really mean it because maybe they just want to be nice to me but yeah. if they tell me they be, because of me they managed to pass an exam or they took their english to another level and they really mean it then it there's nothing better than that i guess i agree i have one more question for you when are you coming to brazil to visit me <laughs> We will see about that. First of all, uh, your winter has to pass. If I were to go to Brazil, I would probably go there to avoid winter here. Then you have to come for carnival, which is yeah, great. That, that sounds like fun. Well, to finish, I would like to say that um, I met you a few months ago, but I have learned to admire you, to see the way you work things around you, during this pandemic times, we have to tell people that are around us what we really think and feel. I really appreciate your work. And it's always a pleasure when we exchange a few lines about things. I have learned so much from you up to now. Oh, thank, thank you, Rod. So As always, I'm terrible at taking any kind of compliments. Nothing has changed. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much for accepting doing this with me. The rapid round game. I thought of you because I know that you love games. It's always nice to have you around. When I have the chance, I'm going to be inviting you to collaborate with me. 
And I will always say yes. Great. Thank you for inviting me, Rob. Thank you so much. I hope everybody liked this new segment. I've had my friend Zdenek here. Thank you so much. You're welcome, Rod. Bye. Bye.